What's up everyone? Today's video is a part 2 to the full length knife guide and in today's video we will be covering the best gloves at every single budget starting from $50 all the way up to $40,000. All prices are from CS Float and the price will match the floatware provided as well as the gloves shown in the video. I spent a ton of time checking each glove type to find the cheapest price at which these gloves look clean so y'all will get the absolute best deal when it comes to price and looks. Along with the price, I also provided floatware for every single glove pair so you will know what to look for if you decide to buy one of the gloves in the video. We will start with the cheapest gloves in the game and work our way up to the most high-end and expensive gloves that are currently available in CS2. With that out the way, let's get into the video. We will start in the low to mid-tier budgets, which will cover gloves from $50 to $500. These gloves are the cheapest but provide amazing value along with a great look that you can pair with many knives and skins in CS2. First up we have Emerald Hydra Gloves in field tested at 0.16 wear and these are going to be 50 bucks so the cheapest on the list and there are some pretty nice clean green gloves. Next up we have Unhinged Gloves in field tested at 0.22 wear and these are 10 bucks more at 60 bucks. Very nice gloves that match with a ton of black and white skins in CS2. Moving on we have Duct Tapes at field tested in 0.20 and they're the same price at $60. They will show somewhere but I know a lot of people like Duct Tapes so I included them. Moving on we have Snake Bites at Field Tested and they're going to be 0.16 at $70 and since they're 0.16 they're going to be very low wear and look great as a result. Moving on at the same price point of $70 we have Arboreals in Field Tested at 0.18 so once again low float and it's like a uh, camo look if that's what you're going for. Also at that same price point of $70 we have Desert Shamas and they're actually going to be min wear which is uh, quite impressive at $70 and they're going to be 0.12s cool little pattern and I think they're pretty underrated for 70 bucks. Next up we have transports at field tested and they're going to be 0.18 wear at 80 bucks. These are nice um, yellow gloves that match with a lot of gold gems and uh, gold knives. Next up we have case hardened gloves at field tested 0.18 wear and they're going to be 90 dollars. These are cool gloves that are pattern based and have nice hints of blue and yellow on them. Next up we have Jade Gloves at Field Tested. The wear is going to be 0.20 and we're cracking the $100 price point. Jade Gloves are nice, they're green and have nice bronze little parts on them. At $110 we're going to be rocking the Chard at Field Tested and they're going to be 0.24. Check these out if you want to rock these with uh, Huntsman Knives Vanilla. Next up we have one of my favorite gloves in the game, Overtakes at Field Tested. 0.18 wear, they're going to be $120. These gloves are one of the best in the game in terms of price and looks. Giraffes sit at about $130 and they're actually going to be min wear, 0.10 wear, so very low wear and if you want this animal print, these knives are there for you. At the same price point of $130, we have 4 SDD pads. They're going to be 0.16, so super low field tested and these match with lore knives pretty well. Next up we have one of the best budget green gloves in the game and these are turtles at field tested where it's going to be 0.22 and these sit at about $150. Lunar Reeves are up next at Field Tested, 0.22 wear. They sit at about $160. Check these out if you want to have like a darker knife or a darker inventory. At $170, we can rock the Badlands in a min wear at 0.12. So once again, low wear. And uh, Badlands are honestly pretty cool for, you know, the price that they sit at. Moving on to Blood Pressures at Field Tested. They're going to be 0.24 at $180. Very nice uh, red and black gloves. Not the best, but uh, they honestly do look really good for Moto Gloves. Next up, we have the Eclipses at Field Tested, 0.22 wear. They're going to be about the same price as the Blood Pressures, $180. And uh, I really like the yellow accents on these gloves. They are very clean. At $190, we're going to be rocking the Moguls in Field Tested, 0.20. And uh, these are solid, cheap uh, specialist gloves, but they don't, they're not too crazy. Cracking the $200 price point, we have Polygons in Field Tested, 0.20 wear, and uh, Polygons go great with Phase 4 Dopplers, so check that combo out if you want to pick these up. Razonda Reds are going to be up next at Min Wear, and they're going to be 0.12 at the same price point as $200. Very nice red gloves, check these out with red knives and red skins. Moving on to Smokeouts and Field Tested, these are going to be 0.16 at $220, and in my opinion, these look amazing with Damascus Steel Knives. Making a return are the Overtakes in Min Wear at 0.12 at $230. I love these gloves and I wanted to include them in better wear so you can get a nearly flawless pair. The first sports glove on our list is going to be Big Games and Field Tested, 0.20 wear, and these sit at about $240. These look really good with uh, Tiger Tooth, so uh, try and combine those together to make a great combo. 
And one of my favorite gloves in the game are overprints. They're going to be field tested, 0.18 low float. And they, these sit at about $250. These look so good because the color is so vibrant on them. Now these gloves are actually, we like to call them the IKEA gloves, but these are the field agents at Field Tested. They're going to be 0.24 wear and sit at about $260. If you're looking for red gloves, check out Crimson Webs. They're going to be at the same price at $260 and the wear will be about 0.22. These are pattern based and overall are very nice red budget gloves. Now I know a ton of people don't like Knox, but they are, you know, sports gloves at 0.18 and they are $270. And also they are a full one color of uh, this black and gray color. Moving on to Scarlet Tremaz, they're going to be field tested 0.24 at $300 and these look great with slaughter knives. One of the two only gloves in CS2 to be purple are Imperial plaids. They're going to be 0.20 float for around $330. These look great with ultraviolets. Foundations sit at around $340 and the float will be around 0.22 and uh, these are pretty unique gloves that you know not a lot of people use so check these out as well. Back to some red gloves we have Crimson Weaves at Field Tested 0.20 float. They're going to be around $340 which seems a little high to me but I mean I guess they are pretty clean so uh, I had to include them in the list. One of the absolute best gloves in the game are black ties. They are super clean. They're going to be 0.22 float and sit at about $350. These look amazing with black lambs and any type of black knife. Moving on, we have cool mints in field tested 0.20 float and they're going to sit at around $380. Personally, one of my favorite moto gloves. The color scheme on this is super clean. And of course, we have the cautions in uh, actually min wear at 0.12. They're going to be $390. And I know lots of people like cautions, so here they are at a min wear condition. Cracking the $400 mark, we're going to rock the cobalt skulls and field test. They're going to be 0.20 wear, and these are very clean blue pattern based gloves. A fan favorite from a lot of people are the king snakes. They're going to be 0.26. The price is around $420, and you might want to look for a clean pattern so that these look really good. Super versatile are the fade gloves. We're going to rock these in field tested at 0.22 wear and these sit at about 10 bucks more so $430. Very colorful and pattern based. And like I said previously overprints are one of my favorites so I included them in min wear at 0.12 at $440 if you want to get these super cool cyan gloves in a very nice low flow. Next up is the mid to high tier budgets covering gloves from $500 to $1000. This price range will allow you to get some very nice gloves in good conditions or lower tier gloves in nearly perfect conditions. Kicking things off, we have the Slaughter Hand Wraps in min wear at 0.12 low and these are going to be sitting even at $500. Very nice red fingerless gloves. One of my personal favorites are the Snow Leopards. They're going to also sit at $500 and these will come in 0.22 field tested float. Moving on, we have the Marble Fade Gloves in a field tested, super low field tested float at 0.16 and these are going to be around $580. Super colorful and also pattern based. One of the most slept on gloves are the Tiger Strike Gloves. They're going to be field tested, 0.20 float and the price is $620. Very clean gloves, very nice color palette on the palm and the back of the gloves. On the cheaper side of sports gloves, we have Arids. They're going to be field tested, 0.18 float and sit at $620. Continuing with sports gloves, we have Omegas, which in my opinion look amazing. They're going to be field tested, 0.20 float, and sit at $650. One of the best yellow gloves in the game, period. Next up, we have Pals at Minwear, 0.12 float, and these are going to run you $680. One of the cleanest orange and white gloves in the entire game. Making a return are the Imperial plaids in Minwear, 0.10. I love these gloves, and uh, these are going to run you about $700 to get a very clean pair of these. Emerald webs are a very nice pair of green gloves. They will be in field tested 0.20 wear and cost you $720. Another pair of gloves making a return are the black ties. These are 0.12, so mid wear, very low float, very clean, and they will run you about $750. Last but not least, we have the best red sports gloves in the game, which are slingshots. And these are about $840 if you get them in field tested 0.26 wear. Next up is the expensive range of gloves, covering gloves that sit from $1,000 to $5,000 in CS2. You can get pretty much any gloves in the game that you want at this price point, and they will be in really good or near perfect conditions. Kicking things off in this price range are Snow Leopards. They're going to be Minwear 0.12s, very nice float, and uh, these will run you about $1,000 flat. At around $1,200, you can get Fades Minwear at 0.12 float, and uh, once again, pattern based making a return, and they look amazing with a ton of skins in CS2. 
A fan favorite for red glove enjoyers are the Crimson Kimonos. These are going to be field tested 0.16 low float and run you about $1,400. Also pattern based as well. And of course, we have the super bright vice gloves. They're going to run you about $1,600 and you can get these in 0.22 wear. So they will have some knuckle wear, but other than that, they look very nice. At $1,800, you can pick up some amphibiouses in minwear, and I highly recommend 0.10 float because higher floats, they look very beat, but these gloves are amazing otherwise. Cracking the $2,000 mark, we have Spearmints in field test. They're going to be 0.20 float, and these are $2,400, one of the cleanest gloves in the game, and these are basically all white with this amazing minty color on top of them. One of my favorite blue gloves in the game are the superconductors. They're going to be field tested, 0.20 wear, and these look super futuristic, very unique, and check these out with a Vulcan for $2,600. My favorite green gloves in the game are hedge mazes. They're going to be $2,800 and sit at about 0.20 float, and these are going to be field tested. Amazing green gloves with a very cool hedge maze design on top of them. Last but not least, we of course have the Pandoras and field tested, 0.28 float, and these have a massive price jump at $4,700. Y'all know Pandora's. We have the little gremlin design on the back. And these are super shiny in CS2 now. Lastly, we have the insanely expensive gloves that sit above $10,000. These are the best gloves in the game. And will have the extremely rare factory new condition on them. These gloves are for people who have way too much money and want the best of the best. Cracking the five figure mark are the Crimson Kimono gloves in factory new 0.065 float and these are the best red pattern based gloves in the entire game by far. At $11,400 we have King Snakes in factory new 0.065 float and these are one of the cleanest best looking white gloves that you could literally get in the entirety of CS2. At $14,100 we have Spearmints in factory new. 0.065 float and these look amazing in factory new super clean and uh they command a insane price tag because of it of course factory new vice gloves will be sitting at twenty thousand dollars and the float will be 0.065 and uh th these are a fan favorite for a lot of high-end knife collectors and people who like to run high-end knives with their gloves so <laughs> no wonder these are so expensive the second most expensive glove in the game are hedge mazes at factory new and these will run you a massive $23,600 at 0.065 float. Literally the best green gloves in the game and uh, no wonder these are so expensive. And finally, the most expensive gloves that you can get in CS2 are Pandora's Box Sports Gloves in Factory New at a astonishing $42,500. The best glove with the best condition, super limited, and this is literally as good as it gets. You cannot get better gloves than these. So here's a total of 65 gloves in CS2 for any budget that you could possibly have in mind. Checking every single type of glove in the game took a very long time, so I hope y'all enjoyed the video and maybe found a pair of gloves that you would consider rocking in game. Thank you everyone for the support and love on my recent videos, and I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Peace out guys.